Hey everybody, welcome back to more of The Walking Dead Michelle, episode 2, Give No Shelter. So the last part we um, ran to Sam's house, saved her life, hopefully, and we kind of hinted, hinted at family that Greg's dead. Ooh, we kind of hinted, they, I think they found it, I think they kind of knew that, you know, Greg's, um, Greg's not coming. So now we're uh, having a little flashback moment, a little um, flash vibe moment. Having, she's having a vibe moment. Well, she's trying to figure out what happened to her kids. I mean, they ran here, and I think... I, I don't know, look at the first part of the first episode. Didn't, like, her two kids come out with her husband? So... What happened here? Pink splash. Painting. Oh, it's like a, a... tiger, I think? A tiger, right? That does look like a tiger. Pink splash. Oh. There you go. Touch it so we have a vibe moment. Vibe off it. Five. Oh no. No bye. Uh. Huh? What the heck? Um. Oh yeah, look at this. Yeah, hold up. Colette. Colette. That's a cool name, Colette. Not gonna lie. It's actually a really beautiful name, Colette. Okay, so pink splash. Um. Wow, the whole world's going to shit. Well, it's the start of the zombie apocalypse, so... Wow. Wow. It's just... Wow. What? Is there anybody that we know? Or just like some random walkers? Okay, so how is this helping us find our daughters? Painting. Family photo. Yes, we got her husband in the middle. So, bathroom. Maybe they're in there. Girls? You in here? Um. Aren't they? Hey, I don't, I don't like this. No, they're gonna pop out. They're gonna be zombies. Look in the mirror. Damn. I am bloody as shit. <laughs> That'd be my reaction. Like, damn. Whoever told me wearing this outfit was a good idea. They are fire my outfitter. Maybe they're in the tub. Maybe they're like, yeah, maybe they're like hiding in the hiding from the walkers in the tub. Shit. No. Where the fuck did they go? What the fuck? Okay, I now, now sir, where the where the fuck did they go? Bloody bandages. Oh. Those bloody bandages. Wait a minute. Oh, okay, okay. I think, okay, we're gonna take a really big educated guess. Her husband got bit, right? Her husband, the one that got bit, and he, since, 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 what the fuck? I hate my, I literally hate, like, my stuttering and lisp. I really hate, like, it, it, it sometimes gets, like, out of control at times. So this is what I think happened. Her husband got bit, and because it's like the start of the zombie apocalypse, they don't know that walker bites Know, turn make you into a walker. So her husband told her husband the like came to the house when when the room walkers attacked. Then, um the one they didn't make it though. Well the walkers attacked. Michonne basically would all kill Bill and fucking fuck their day up. And then the two daughters go to the husband for safety. Like holy shit, you know, mobs kill Bill and all these walkers. Let's go a day, you know, for protection. And dad turns into a walker and just kind of guess what happens. I don't want to kind of guess what happens. You lay a corpse, broke condition of blood. Yeah, see, he's starting to feel a little faint, like, oh, oh, I feel like I'm turning into a walker. What the hell happened to you? Yeah, their husband. Yeah, that's what I think happened. I'm not sure. I don't think they really specify what happened to Michelle's family in the show. I think they just, I think they just showed, like, I know her husband and her younger brother died. Read out. Reach Michelle. <laughs> Please leave a message after. They tried to call me. Hey, they're right. How did I miss that? We could be too busy to kill on everybody. That's why. We're too. Oh, so he tried to call you like, honey, I'm not feeling well, or like, honey, some crazy guy bit me. You know, I don't feel too good. Something like that, maybe. Oh. 
I left this all behind. To my hand. <laughs> oh, just, um, my hand, you know. <laughs> I'm just, uh. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Wait, no, I'm sorry. I'm just, um, talking to my hand, you know. Did, did you say Donna? Um. Right, right, um. Donna is a friend of mine who got eaten the fuck up by walkers. You okay? Just thinking about someone I once knew. Who got eaten the fuck up by walkers? It's okay. I do that too. It's a good thing. He keeps us sane ish. <laughs> sane ish. John, he. He went to talk to the kids, make sure they're alright. Yeah. So. While I watched over you. Because you still don't trust me. I get it. Nice gun you got there. Sorry about this. John isn't big on people he doesn't know. How are the kids? How are the kids holding up? I don't know. Can't be good. Yeah, losing a sibling. Their brother's dead, sister's shot. I mean, fuck, right? I know, right. I know the feeling. I mean, I lost two kids, too, to the walkers. My so, husband's dead. Yeah. Uh, this is where I apologize for almost shooting you. Ah, that's cool. You're just, protecting her. You're just protecting what you cared for. It's cool. You're just protecting your family. Emphasis on almost. I was just worried. Don't worry about it. You know. Happens more often than I like to admit. You're just protecting your family. I get it. If it makes you feel any better, I'm not a great shot. <laughs> uh, I'll teach you. Don't worry. That patch of dirt? His mom's buried there. Damn. You're so back, she just... Wow. She was sick. She was infected. Not in the head. Something with her heart. Oh. Yeah, that's, that's real sad. I can relate. No, all right. Well, I can relate to like losing like a losing like she couldn't like, handle it. I, I guess. I never understood that. Yeah, you can't give in. Yeah. You have to keep going. No matter what. I mean, I know the thing. When, when Sam you, like, said the same thing like, to her mom. That was just a few days before. I know, like, when the feeling, she like, deep depression. Did it? I know the feeling. So I've never I, seen I, I Sam so that. angry. I know. I know the feeling he's going through. I know the feels. If it wasn't for Sam. Sam. Hey, don't move, okay? Don't move. Sam, no. Don't move. Yeah, she still moved. Fuck your room. 
Hey, Please, Sam. shouldn't we have to help him? You're too weak. Pull me up. Just stay down, Sam. I need to help him. You're hallucinating, Sam. I... Greg isn't here, okay? Sam. <laughs> She's like, oh, sleepy time. Hey. Oh, your dog was just hallucinating the shit out of hallucinating things. She's just having a little Silent Hill moment. Don't worry. I know John can make a strong first impression. You think? But he's what's keeping this entire family from being buried out there. He's a good man. You gotta fight like hell for what you care about, right? Right. Something that makes all this shit worth it. Fight until the day you die. Yeah. Fight until the day you die. Damn right. You'd be crazy to stay here, John. Yeah. This woman normally will... There's no decision to be made on this. I need a word with you. All right. What do you want to talk about? In private. Ooh, that's... That's not good. Okay, I guess he kind of wants the details on, you know, his son. You know. Yeah, that's understandable. He wants to know exactly what happened. You know. He wants to know, did he, did he suffer? You know, did he turn into a walker? Was he fit? You know, he... What happened to his daughter? I, I understand that. Okay. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll tell you what happened. I'll, I'll tell you what happened. Don't worry. Machete is only for the walkers. And for the people who pour a gun to my head. Alright, so. We want to start the combo. Me or you. It's been uh, rainy out here. Show me, um. You know, talk somewhere where there's not rain. <laughs> kind of like, um, not being wet and sick and COVID. Do you have children? A son? Two daughters. I do. Two little girls. They, um, didn't make it. Damn. <sighs> yeah, she, um, the babysitter told me what happened to her. Uh, sorry. It snowed the day my wife died. Her heart gave out. Sam found her. She... She passed in her sleep. And she died peacefully. We buried her so the boys wouldn't have to see her like that. The snow... It covered her grave. He erased it. Like she'd never been there at all. I'm really sorry for your loss. Yeah, at least you're peaceful. Thank you. I've tried to focus on our kids, but the past, it always seems to find you. What are you telling me? Ever since Sophia, I've tried to keep our family from harm. You did a good job at so far. We're falling apart, piece by piece. And now that Sam's hurt, and Greg's... Yeah, I am. I could really use your help. Um, help your friend Pete told me all about Norma, about what happened. If she finds us, we wouldn't stand a chance. I'll do what I can. But you seem like someone who can hold their own. You've got a good thing going here. Safe house. Nice family. It's more rare than you know. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. <sighs> Children shouldn't have to see this. Yeah, right. Look, Clementine seems to be doing well, so... <laughs> Greg never turned into one of these things, did he? Are those whatever they are? He's at peace now. He's at peace now. <gasps> Thank God. It's okay. Too late. Like, nah, now, good time. I... I'm sorry. Don't apologize. I'm trying to keep it together. Okay, don't apologize. But what if you just found out your daughters were dead? They are. <laughs> they are dead. And you weren't there. 
Um, I don't know if they're there or not, but I know they're dead. You were miles away, safe and sound. How would you feel? You have to stay strong. Your kids need you to stay strong. You, you're right. I'm all they have. Whoa! What the? Oh! Holy shit! Peekaboo. Fucking oh, Okay, you know what? That that draws the line. No, that draws the fucking line. You are fucking dead, Randall. Holy fuck. Okay, you know that fucking draws the line. Like a rat. Find her. Okay, you know what? Fucking draw the line, okay. I'm gonna get that gun. I'm gonna shove it straight up your ass. Fucking Bitch! Alright, get the kid, take him upstairs. Make him hide. Get, put Sam and the kids in the hiding spot. You too. Give me the gun. You know what? Fuck the gun, I want the machete. No, I want no, I want fucking Randall. I'll take the one near the fountain. What fucking Randall? Alright, they'll just solid top. Sneaky sneaky. Alright, you're not there, you know. Where are you? Wonder where I am? Stay still and I'll show you. Huh? Oh, nothing. Uh, that's right. Surprise, you fucker! I'll be taking that, thank you. Do something. Do something. Fuck. Bitch! I thought not. No, leave him to bleed out. Leave that bitch to bleed out. Oh, oh no, no, no. You put a gun on me. I will take him a gun, left him to bleed out. Okay, I'll do that. I will left him to bleed out so the walkers can. Oh, shit, don't you fuck. Randall, if you kill her, I swear to you, Randall, you kill her, I will show you no fucking mercy. Do it, Randall. Do it, Randall. I fucking dare you. Shetty. Yo, beat your ass. Beat your ass. Fucking ass. Come on, bitch. Huh? Now you want. Fucking kill a noble father, you little bitch! Okay, okay, me and you, Randall. Me and you. Let's go. Let's fuck you. Okay, oh, okay, oh, okay, okay. Okay, okay, you are still. Bitch, I have enough of this shit. Get off. Okay, alright. No more nice Michelle. Get the fuck off me. Get the fucking shit. Oh, you bitch. Oh. Uh, fuck you! Fuck you! How you let me fucking take the blood? You motherfucking shit! Fuck you! And your fucking bitch ass face! I'm not done with you yet. Lock him in! Uh, oh, yeah! Fucking like that, don't you, bitch? You all right? Not dead yet. Uh, uh, you? Damn. Uh, yeah. Time to make this little bitch sing. Sing. Life is out, Jeff. Yeah, come on. Oh, yeah, well, shit indeed. You must be pretty proud of yourself. Yeah, right, I am. Cut yourself a golden goose. I think I'm shitting any eggs. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> you will say that. <laughs> Jesus! Whoa! You don't mess around. Yeah, I don't, don't I? <laughs> I like that. I think you do them there and let them all give out. 
I see you leave it here for the walkers. How'd you find that? How'd you find the house? You know, I probably never would have. Except you left a trail of walker parts right to the front gate. Ooh. Forgot about that. <laughs> like some fucked up fairy tale. Randall? Randall, are you getting this? You, uh, want to get that for me? We heard gunshots. If you don't check in, I'm sending everyone in that direction. Shit. She sounds pissed. Randall, pick up, goddammit. You gonna answer? Talk to her, Michonne. You heard her. Randall needs to check in. Make one fucking move. You know, wrong move. this feels mighty familiar. Except you're there. And I'm Make here. Make one wrong move, I'll chop your dick off. So, Miss Show, what do you want me to say to her? On account of me hoping to avoid more broken fingers. Call her off. Your wish is by command. Call off your sister. Or I break every bone in your hand. I'll play nice. Hey, Norma. Randall, are you all right? Yeah, I'm all right. Hey! I wasn't finished yet. I don't care. I was doing what you said, Michelle. You said all you needed to. Nice try. Nah, you want a thought, bitch. <laughs> yes, I'm okay. I'm Randall. Ooh. Randall? I lost you. What what were you saying? Shut off the radio. Okay, have a girl, huh? No I won't know something's wrong soon oh, enough. Shit. If I can find you, she'll find you. You know, this alone time, you and me together, it's been real you know, nice. Even more nice? But that all ends when my sister gets yeah, here. Well, not the walk you did here first. Jeez. I'm gonna take that wrench and break your skull. Then Sam's and yours. And last this but not least, those kids. Okay, too. now you die. Now you die. I saw their little heads in the window. Now you die. You don't threaten kids. No. Kids. You know, their skulls don't break so much as... Kind of melt. I'm sorry, what was that? I couldn't hear you over the sound of the breath in your fucking head. I'm sorry, you walked in, I guess? Yes, I hit a button. Michelle. Get back inside, get back inside! Well, hey now. Don't you two look like your daddy. Back when he still had a face. Okay, you're getting hit again. You're getting hit again. <laughs> Sam, you wanna What? Yeah. Got a big hole there now. <laughs> okay, you know what, Randall? Sean, is that true? Yeah. <laughs> Please tell me he's fucking with us. Sam, I'm I'm sorry. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> no. Kill Randall. Kill that little fucker. James! <laughs> Maybe be killed by dad. Then why isn't this son of a bitch dead? First good question asked all night. Michonne's just been fumbling around like a bear cub. He's a valuable a football. Randall has more value if he's alive. He gives us something to bargain with when Norma gets Listen here. Listen to me. That won't work. They only bargain with bullets. Has her brother. All she wants is her brother back. That's it. We're out of the equation. You need to kill him, or I will. Yeah, I can't agree with you. I want to kill Randall, but Sam, wait. I want to kill. Him. No matter what I say, you're just gonna do whatever you want anyway. I know you've already made up your mind. Oh, I don't know. Yeah. I ain't I had the battle of the ball. Well, maybe that's you. Because when this dance is over, you're fucked. Okay. Kill me, and Norma hunts you down until you're all dead. Fucked! Let me live, and I do even worse. You're fucked. But we both know how this is gonna end, Michonne. Well, you did threaten the kid. You like killing. 
Yeah. I take my chances with the door, but I'd rather kill you. Just tell old Randall the truth. I got thick skin. Better you than me. I'm sure you'd like to see me dead, too. Better you than me. If it's in the cards. Or maybe. Maybe you think you can rise above all that. <laughs> oh, I am so There ain't doing. no heaven Come up on, dude. Give me the option to kill the fucker. And there ain't no hell down below. There's only this shit every day until you die. And you know what's the fucking kicker? You get up and keep walking. This is a fucking point. If you got a point, get to it already. On my way, darling. I'd rather kill you instead. This is the world your kids are dying in, Michelle. Okay, now you die. <gasps> now you fucking die. You stepped over the line way too many times. Or died in. Or are in that rockin' purgatory. Shut up. Don't talk about that. Either way. They're suffering. Oh, give me the option, game. And mommy isn't there. Give me the option. Give me the fucking option. We all Fuck have you, our okay? You, you've lived long enough. You can't hurt anyone ever. You can't hurt anybody ever more. Yet. He can't hurt anyone ever again now. Quiet time. Thank you for killing that fucker. Jeez. Next time on The Walking Dead Show. I spent a lot of time in low, low places. Where you only have your thoughts for company. And those can be mean, nasty. You want to believe all lives and all deaths have a purpose. Believe me, they don't. It's true. Things always fall apart. But we're the ones who bring them down. Damn. So in true tall tale fashion, Episode 3 is where shit the fan. Let's, let's see how we did. Did you keep Pete with you or let him go off on his own? I kept him with us, okay? I like Pete. Did you pick up the phone and go after your footsteps in the hallway? I picked up the phone. Wow, wow. Not a lot of people picked up the phone. You revealed to Pete that you nearly committed suicide. Wow. Tried to offer some good advice. I wow, a lot of people did offer good advice. Wow. Did you handle a radio call from Norma? It showed to make Randall speak to her. Wow, wow so a lot of people... Did like wow! Well, I'm surprised that I'm like on the like I'm not on the majority of like choices on this part. Did you? What did you do with Randall? Yeah, I killed Randall because like what the like seriously that bitch needed to die. I, he was not living. I'm sorry, but he stepped over the line way too much. He kills like a whole bunch of people. He's a savage beast. He tried to kill us. He killed technically he like tried to kill Greg. He killed like a lot of people, and he it didn't seem like he was stopping anytime soon. So I need to kill. I need to get him out. The holy shit, that was part, that was like episode two, The Walking Dead Michelle. So the, when we come back, it will be the episode three, the final episode. And what it seems like, it seems like the Norma finds the camp, and I think killing your brother. She's not going to be happy, but you know what? I'm fucking ready. Let's fucking go. I'm fucking ready. Time to end Norma's reign of fuckery once and for fucking all. Oh. So thank you everybody for watching. Oh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you want me to kill fucking Norma. I said I was gonna kill freaking Randall. I killed Randall. I said I'm gonna kill Norma. I'm fucking gonna kill Norma. Shit. She needs to, Norma needs to die. I'm tired. I like. I do not like like tyranny. I do not like people in apocalypses who are like, oh yeah, I'm gonna kill you because I can kill you now. Like, oh, the apocalypse, I can do whatever I want. I'm gonna kill you because I'm better than you. No. Those people in like apocalypse, they like, you know they're gonna die. And I like, I hate those characters in like any zombie apocalypse, any apocalypse. Whatsoever, I hate those characters. Or the people that are like, I'm better than you, so I'm gonna kill you and everyone you love just for the fucking next. So, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I'll be seeing you all in the next Walkery Film part. Bye, guys! Bye!